It is Tuesday and it's time for our pet of the week segment. Joining me now, Tiffany Rose from Bubbles Dog Rescue. And we also have Haley Schaefer. Haley <laughs> Schaefer here as well. Um, this is a nonprofit that's founded by two sisters. Um, and this is an all women volunteer team who go ahead and pull dogs off of the euthanasia list throughout California. And you're joining us here today. So thank you so much for being part of our pet of the week segment. Yeah, this thank is great. You. We're so excited. Um, and tell us who we have here. So this is Onyx. Um, he's 4.5 years old. He's an Akita mix. Um, we like to refer to him as a gentle a giant. Um, he's actually our newest addition. He was abandoned at boarding. Aww. I know it's so sad, but um, we've had him for about, I think like a day so far yeah. and we wanted to bring him here. He's absolutely a dream. Um, Akitas are amazing dogs, very loyal, great family dogs. He's great with all humans from adults to kids and loves other dogs as well. He is so cute and so calm and well behaved. Mm -hmm. um, if someone is new to the rescue or adoption process or even just having uh, a dog in their home, do you guys have any tips for them? Yeah, um, I'd say it's always important to make sure you do your research, um, know what kind of dog is best for you. If you're not sure, um, we would always be happy to pair you with a dog that we know would be a great fit for you. Um, so do your research, prepare your home. Um, it's like bringing like a kid into your house. Mm -hmm. um, you gotta make sure that there's not things that they can get into um, and just you know, be ready to love another little animal in your life. Um, these dogs are amazing and they are so willing to, you know, share their love and receive love as well. I love this. Okay, so tell me about the adoption process. If someone's watching right now, they're interested in Little Onyx. Yeah, so if they are interested in Onyx, they can go over to our website. That's bubblesdogrescue.org um, and fill out an application. So once they've filled out the application, they can indicate that they're interested in Onyx. Um, we also have some more information on there about him. Um, and then we'd schedule a meet and greet for them to meet Onyx and see how um, you know they like him and see if it would be a good fit for their family. Um, and then if all goes well, hopefully Onyx would be in their family. <laughs> he is so cute. I love that he just keeps on yawning. He's like, just someone take me home so I can continue my nap, please. Um, tell me a little bit about the organization. Yeah, so um, we have rescued over 300 dogs in the last year alone. To over 250 of them um, are in forever homes. Um, and then we have about 60 right now in rescue that are currently waiting for their, their perfect fit. Um, so it's great dogs like Onyx and we have, um, you know, small dogs, big dogs, just everything you can think of um, and they're all just waiting for their their perfect match. I love him. He's like a little teddy bear. Um, only a kind of a big teddy bear, but yes. so <laughs> extremely cute. He's adorable. Lots of lots of love. You can tell he's a great, great pup. So thank you so much for joining me. Really appreciate it. Uh, and if you want more information, we're going to put all of this up on our screen and also on our websites. So people can contact you, get in touch with Onyx. Um, so really excited to have you here when we do this segment every single Tuesday for our pet of the week. So you can go over to kcalnews.com slash the morning wrap for more information.